Hey guys, Coach Kasu here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Leaf Green I just recorded. Anyway, yeah. I bought some more Ultra Balls, which, uh, I'll show you, but I made it, I went here to the power plant off screen, and I bought 29 more Ultra Balls because I had 21. So, wait for that. And I don't, I'm not gonna use my Master Ball on what I'm gonna try and catch. So, I mean, it would be a lot. Bay. It would bay. No. It would be a lot easier, but yeah. So, in the last episode, we beat the gym at Fleetian City and beat up Giovanni. And we got the move Earthquake from him, which has a hundred act. Wow, Cat can learn it? Eh, no, I'm gonna teach it to Cookie. So, yes. Uh, now what move to. Mo what move to we move? Uh, I really wanna get rid of Dig. Because this is all. It takes two turns and it's only 16 and 100. This, however, does is 100 and 100 and it only takes one turn. But. I kinda wanna keep Rock Blast. I mean, it's not all that powerful though. It only does 25, like, per. Stomp can make people flinch, and Ice Beam is obviously an ice, and it can freeze people's out, which will be useful actually. So. And you know what, Dig is useful to get out of dungeons if you're really far in. So I'm gonna get rid of Rock Blast. That's probably a bad idea, but you know what? It, it can't be that bad, can it? Anyway, Cookie learned Earthquake. Now let's look what else we have in here. We have Brick Break. Who can learn that? Uh, Cookie and Cat, no. Oh, maybe. I might get rid of Lane Dance for it. Double Team, not you. worth it. Not worth it. Is it? Well, Shockwave might actually be good. It's power is 60. Torment Super Power Advanced Track Skills from Snatch. Eh. Don't look like. Yeah, Solo Beam, I would teach someone in Giga Drain too, but no one can learn it. All these grass moves taunting me. And you know, Water Pulse, I could teach to somebody, but. Eh. Yeah, okay. And then all these are just rudimentary. Is that the word I'm looking for? I think it is. I don't know. But anyway, let's go inside the power plant. I don't think you've seen that animation, so, okay. So, obviously, in this place is gonna be electric type Pokemon, because, I mean, it's called the power plant, and you found a max potion. So, I'm still gonna keep Drago. Actually, uh. What level's Cookie? No, I'm gonna put Cookie out spot. Because. I want to get Cookie levels, and Cookie might not be getting that much levels for but, I mean, this this place's Pokemon aren't that powerful, from what I remember. Yeah, 31, that's not amazingly powerful, but these guys have Levitate, don't they? Uh, I want to check. No, they don't, okay. It's something else. I think that's coughing. Why do I think, well, obviously I think these guys Levitate because it looks like they're Levitating, but, you know what I mean. 713, and that's... Decent experience. Okay, what's down here? I'm not running because that just tracks Pokemon faster. You know what? I just thought of something. I have a ton of Max Appels, don't I? Why don't I just use those? Why do I use Ice Beam? Dude, you're not thinking. I would face palm, but that would be so loud. Maybe not so loud, but haha. -ha. An effect me, biatch. Boom in your face. Anyway, that was interesting. Oh. Of course you would, Pikachu, you douche bagel. What are you, Chansey now? Apparently. Uh, where is my port Klaus's heal? It's not up there, but I'll use Max Pal. Okay. So, yeah. There's Paralyzed Heal. Okay. I think I'm gonna keep Cookie out for the thing that's here. If any of you don't know, I'm just trying not to spoil it for you. Okay. Oh, let's go over here, because I think there's an item here. There is. Hello. Oh, it's a trap. It's a trap. How do you fool that for a Pokeball? It doesn't even have an opening, and it's way bigger. You stupid trainer. Anyway. Haha, -ha, your moves can affect us, but mine can affect you. And you die, like, instantly. Yeah, you do die instantly. Yeah, you could catch Electrodes, Voltorbs, and Pikachus here. I'm kind of tempted to, but, you know, secret item? No, okay. I'm 
kind of tempted to, but Drago already has Thunderbolt, and I'll probably teach him Thunder if I ever get it, because I have Rain Dance, so that'll make it automatic hitting. Oh, wow. Oh, speaking, <laughs> speaking of Thunder, there's Thunder. But, hold on. I want to check it, because... I'm curious. Open. Thunder, how much P how much um power points does it have? Uh, it has ten. Blue lightning may also lead to paralyzed. Yeah, see look, it's a power of 120 and accuracy of 70. It's an amazing move, but I don't wanna look at Thunder Bolt. But no not switch. Done it. Okay, so Thunderbolt has fifteen power of ninety-five and yeah, that's really good. I could. I think I might actually just get rid of agility for it. Heck. Sure, why not? I'll teach. Um, Drag of Thunder. Oh, but if I get a better move later on. No, I can just get rid of Thunder Shock then. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna teach Thunder to. Yeah, Cookie can learn it too, which is kind of ironic. But, yes, I will teach it to Drago. Because he is the, uh, she, whatever gender they are, I don't even remember, I think it's a male. But anyway, yeah. Because it's my main Thunder type user. So yeah. Because since I don't have an electric type of one, I mean, I could get one. Just to, like, have it. But I don't think it would be that useful. Ah, darn it. Because, um, Drago already had Thunder Shock. I mean, I could've got rid of, could've got rid of something for it, but, um, yeah, oh, down in self-destruct, haha, not that effective, because I'm rock type, suck it, rock type has strong defense, oh, and I get the experience board anyway, okay, that's good, and get this Pokeball over here, is it an actual item, it is, Thunderstone, that evolves, what does it evolve, Eevee into Jolteon, I don't think it evolves any other po- No, it does. It evolves Pikachu into Raichu, that's it. The puzzle effect will off. Down it. It evolves Pikachu into Raichu, so that's useful. Uh, where's Max Power? There we go. Yeah. The battles aren't really so annoying, but I just don't wanna face, like, 5,000 the same dude. When I just don't have to. Okay. So this is where he is. Which is the Pokemon Zapdos. And I be I don't believe they run away. So I believe you can catch him no matter what. But I'm actually gonna switch into someone weaker. Um I don't wanna switch into UADC because she'll just get killed. I'll switch into Drago. Because Cookie's moves move set. I don't think it will... Actually, no. I'm gonna switch back. Cause... Yeah. So this is the Zapdos fight. Like the music here. Go, Cookie. Yeah, Zapdos is a level 50 Pokemon. He is one of the three legendary bow type Pokemon. So let's take him on. He's obviously Thunder oriented. So... I think, I believe he has all Thunder type moves. So electric type moves, so he can't affect Cookie in any way. Oh, detect. He can do that. Protect himself. Yeah, I think they all have detect, all of the three legendary birds. But obviously the moves are different because they're different. I almost said elements. Types. Derp. Okay. So anyway, wow, really? So why Stop is not getting whatchamacallit's flinches, and yeah, that's fine. He's just alternating between Thunder Wave and that. Even though he knows it doesn't do anything, jeez. Thunder Wave, stop using Thunder Wave! <laughs> okay. How low is he? Ooh, okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna try an Ultra Ball. Okay, let's go for it! Come on! Oh. Drill Pack. Oh, Goodness. That's nice. Uh, let's use Ice Beam. Try and get him frozen. Please don't kill him. Please don't kill him. Thank you. And you didn't please him. Down it, Cookie. I don't have any moves that give status ailments, do I? I don't think I do. So let's just keep spamming Ultra Balls. They'll eventually work. Eventually. <laughs> Hopefully. 
Come on. Oh, nah. That did not work so well. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, I wanna... Okay. Summary. Okay. I'll switch through all my Pokemon. I, I don't believe any of them has an attack that does status ailment. No. That might be bad. And I don't have any status inducing items, do I? Because I have Pokeballs. I have berries. I don't think berries will be of much help. Max Appels won't either. Actually, yeah. Let's just keep spamming Ultra Balls. Because I don't want to kill him. Because I want to try and catch him. Because he's a legendary bird, obviously. Oh, what? Not even close. It's because I'm not using Down B. Is that the secret to all catching Pokemon? Okay. Let's go. Down B. Nope. This is just holding B. I don't know. But it failed. Epic fail. You suck. Eat my Ultra Ball. Yeah, this is why you want to buy a lot of them, because this happens. If you don't have a status inducing um, attack, this is probably what's going to happen. Kind of sucks, but you know, can't really do anything about it. What? I'm not even getting anything now. I'm going to use Jewel Peg, dude. It's not nice. Yeah. I mean, I would use a uh, status inducing item, but I can't since I don't have any. Oh, come on. Oh, down it. Okay, I got one. I got one shake on it. I got one. One shake. I'm trying to get two this time. Oh, none. That's fine, too. Yeah, see, th this is why you want um, a ton of things. And wow. Just increases speed. That's not what I need. That rhymed. Whatever. This is why you want a lot of Ultra Balls, because this is prone to happen. Yeah, and then he's just gonna spam agility. Good for you. My Ultra Balls always go first anyway. Yeah, I'm not gonna use my Master Ball, because there's something much better I will use it on later. Trust me. Save your Master Ball. Save it, or I will murder your face. No, not really. I don't think that's even possible. Anyway. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. No! I had two shakes! Damn you, random number generator. Why are you not friends with me? Catch the Don Zapdos. Come on. No! Got one shake that time. Come on. Yeah, your speed won't go any higher. Stop using agility. Actually, keep using agility. You won't kill Cookie that way. Just spam Ultra Balls in the face. Oh, come on. Dude. Dude. Don't detect. I think he's out of detects now, though, because it only has five power points. Okay. Come on. Oh. Um, Maybe not. Zapdos, you're prolonging my video. Come on. This is the only thing I really want to do in this episode. Because I could go to the one of the other ones. Which I probably will. I'll just like get to the main place. But yeah. So let's just keep spamming Ultra Balls at him. Fun times. Come on. I'll down it. I always get excited when there's one shit. Because I'm like, oh my god, it's going to work. But it doesn't. Yeah. Status inducing items aren't that great except for things like these. Good points like these. Come on! No! You douche! You douche, you're even more of a douche than Chansey! Maybe you waste 17 balls on you! Jeez! I paid $800 for these balls, good sir. Ah, uh, and Cookie's dead. Okay. One second, I am going to go answer the phone. Okay, wait. Okay, we're back. Just readjusting my mic there. That call was a lot shorter than the other one. But anyway, let's send out Drago. Go for it, Drago. Don't kill him, though. Use spam Ultra Balls in his face. Come on. Darn it. Yeah. Eventually, there will come a point in time when I have to kill him. Holy crap. You know what? Pokeball. Go. If this catches him, I'm going to raffle Mao so hard. Yeah, I didn't think so. If an Ultra Ball doesn't catch him, I doubt a Pokeball will. I think I actually got one of the legendary birds with a Pokeball once. If I remember correctly. 
just use Glade Ball, why not? Is it gonna work? No, it isn't. That's what I thought. Yeah. I caught one of them with a Pokeball once. It was just like, what the f- It doesn't make any sense whatsoever, but okay. You know what? Send out Yudasu, why not? Okay. So, yeah. Obviously, catching the legendary birds is no small task. You have to have a ton of Ultra Balls and crap. I mean, you could just use your Master Ball, but again, I want to save that for something way later. Maybe not way later, but holy crap, dude. Jeez. Doing 125 damage with that Drill Pack, you gotta be running out of PP soon. And that is another factor in this fight, which is... If if he gets all his moves down to no peep, uh, power points, because if he does, he will start using Struggle. And Struggle is a move that is used by all Pokemon when they run out of power points, and it does recoil damage to you. So you can see how that can be bad. He can kill himself with that. And I do not want that to happen. If he, if he does, then too bad I didn't catch him, because I'm not going to use save states, because I don't really abuse them. I mean, for Minish Cap I will, because, I'm, I mean, I missed something that could be really good. But yeah. Come on! No! Down you false hope! Why are you so mean to me? And you already see dead. Okay. Yes, I want to use next Pokemon. And the question is that, is it not zero? Okay. Keep spamming them Ultra Balls in his face, I guess? Sounds so inappropriate, but anyway. Oh, dude, stop filling me with false hope. It's not nice. Stop filling me with false hope. S time. I mean, what? No, not really. No Final Fantasy 13 references. Come on, come on. Oh, dude. Yes, it appeared to be caught. Stop taunting me, game. It's not very nice of you. I think you might be out of drill pack. I don't know how much power points drill pack has. Maybe. Oh, come on. Kitty, you are not making this easier by pawing at the door for no apparent reason. I can't let you in because then you'll make noise and crap. You'll probably knock down the tree or something. That wouldn't be good. Doing recording, just the cat just jump on the tree and make it fall down. That that would not be good. Itch. Yeah. Anyway, how how are you guys doing today? There's nothing really else to talk about. How you guys doing? I'm okay. Yeah. Like I said last episode, today was the last day of school until after New Year's, which is good. We didn't really do anything. The only class who actually learned anything, basically, was math. It was like a three minute lesson of less than a... of... less than and greater than on graphs, which is just a bunch of lines and solution sets and all that, which we learned last year. So, yeah. Trigonometry for the win. Not really. Oh my gosh, I'm running out of Ultra Balls. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Yes! Yes! Bitch, get in my balls. That sounded wrong, but whatever. Oh my gosh, that was like 40 Ultra Balls. No, I will not give a name to Zapdos. Holy crap, that took forever. Although not really, because it's only at like 20 minutes. Oh! Jeez. Okay. So, what did we learn today? We need status inducing moves for the other ones. That's what we learned. Okay. So, yeah. Half my team is dead. Zero's paralyzed. Uh, just fly back to Gwydian City, why not? Ugh. That was terrible. Terrible. Anyway. Yeah. So, let's go heal up. And then we can look at Zapdos in the PC that we just caught. Oh my gosh. That was... That was crazy. It would have been a lot easier if... Because... I don't know if I talked about it, but... Status inducing moves reduce... Uh, increase the catch rate, actually. Is what I mean to say. Yeah, so if you look, right here is Zapdos. So let's take a look at his summary. Yeah, he's an electric flying type, which is, I believe, why, whatchamacallit, was super effective. Ice Beam? Yeah. 
That's why Ice Beam was super effective against him before. Serious nature, yeah. Pressure raises for PP usage, which... I don't think it actually... Oh, actually, I didn't really use uh, Power Punch anyway, but... That is a really good thing, because for stuff like Detect... So instead of using one Power Point for it, you have to use two or three. I'm pretty sure it's only double, like, two. So yeah, it has... Thunder Wave, Agility, Detect, Drill Pack. It's not the best Pokemon ever. It has Thunder Wave, which paralyzes instantly. So I might use that to catch the other Legendary Birds. I might put them on my team just for that part. Which I probably will. But he's decent. He has Detect, Drill Pack, Agility. Agility isn't all that useful. You could teach more Thunder-type moves for him and use him on your team. But I think he's... I'd just say overpowered. But yeah, look, look at the stat difference, lol. Like, tens to a hundreds. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Uh, douchebagel. Good old douchebagel. Yeah. All my Pokemon in here. Doopy. Yeah. Lapis. What's Lapis's moveset anyway? Or Lapis's? I don't even remember. Miss, Body Sun, Confuser, Parish Song. What the heck does Parish Song do? Any battle that hears this faints in three turns unless it switches. Wow, that's actually kind of good. Phone! Hold on a second. Okay. There. Okay, so hopefully I don't get interrupted anymore this episode. So I'll probably just end it right here, which I will, actually. I did heal my Pokemon again. Just con conscience. Con conscientious? If I can speak, I think that's how it's pronounced. Conscientious. I don't know, but anyway, in the next episode, uh, hmm, actually, you know what, I want to check something really fast, I think you can actually get the tri-pass just by going to Vermilion, just by going there, I may be wrong, but, because, like I said, one of the three legendary birds is there, but I want to do them, like, all in the same, around the same time, so I want to see. Ah, you have a tri -pass. Wait, what? I do have a tri-pass. Huh. I didn't think I did. Oh, now that I think about it, yeah, Bill gave us one, didn't he? Oh, no, I remember. Yeah, okay, so... I'm gonna go to One Island, because that is the place where we... Well, that is where I'm gonna go for the next... person, Legendary Bird thing. So... In the next episode... You know what? I'm gonna go first. Again, self-conscientious about that. Oh my gosh, I said that on my first try. Ridiculous. Yeah, okay, so let's do that. And in the next episode, we will talk to Celio, see what's going on, and then we will go catch the second legendary bird out of three. In the order I'm collecting them, that is. There's not really a specific order, but anyway, yeah. So this is Coach Casio, signing out. Have a great day, everybody.